Hey, it's Dr. Schmidt. I want to share with you the story about a product called Carboxy Powder. Now, this is new on the market, and uh, but I've had it in my possession for over a year so that I could test it out. And this is from the company called Cellcore Biosciences. So here's the story. October of 2019, I was at a seminar put on by this company, and uh, the, one of the owners of the company gave me this sample right here. And when I got home, I took it, you put it in water, and you drink it. And I got really, really bloated. It was very uncomfortable. And I thought, well, okay, I'm not going to do this again. So I just closed the lid, set it aside. And nine months later, eight months later, I was being interviewed for a seminar by the Cellcore uh, company. And they had a woman interviewing me. And before the actual interview started, we were just chatting. And it turns out she had a similar experience that I had regarding an exposure to toxic mold. And she lived in a house for six months, her and her fiance, and it was just devastating for their health and their relationship, and they broke up. And um, when she got out, she went on the, the correct supplements. And we were talking about the supplements that she and I both were on, and that includes this one, Biotoxin Binder. I'm still on this four years after uh, discovering the mold. This has been absolutely fantastic for cleaning out the mycotoxins that mold makes. And I can see it in the lab work, the numbers coming down. Absolutely fantastic. Then I went on some other supplements from Cellcore Biosciences and I got rid of parasites, 12 in the first two weeks, and two out of my nose. And you can see videos I made in the past talking about this. Uh, since I have no shame nor pride, I don't care that you hear all the grossest things that I talk about regarding healthcare and the experiences that I went through to get my health back and uh, you know parasites and all that kind of stuff you're gonna hear more in a few minutes okay so as we're talking she says to me wait until you get on carboxy and I was like wait a minute I have that I haven't used it in eight or nine months so I ran into another room and I grabbed it I was like look I have it right here and she said the goal is to do one teaspoon a day which at the time was is way too much. Now the dosage is one eighth of a teaspoon. But um, here's a little scooper that I that came with this. See how black it is? It's a nutrient from soil. It's um, fulvic acid and humic acid, and it's uh, manipulated, if you will, in their lab to be super super powerful, and to be very high in hydrogen, carbon, and oxygen, and especially hydrogen. When you have a lot of hydrogen in a food or nutrient, it's acidic. It smells like vinegar. It cleans your nose out just as you breathe it in. It's a little bit almost magnetic. I know nobody's going to agree with me on that, but it sticks to things. And it is a binder. I mean, technically, it goes into that realm of, of binding toxins out of your body. So it's definitely very sticky. Knowing that a little bit would make me very bloated. I started with what's called a microdose, and you take that uh, scoop and you just tap it like this into the water, and you get a little bit in the water, and then you stir it up, and the water turns black, drink it. I did this on the first night at about 8 or 9 o'clock at night, and I woke up at 4 o'clock in the morning, and I had to go to the bathroom. The bathroom is attached to the bedroom, and I could not believe what came out of me it was absolutely disgusting the smell was horrific it literally smelled like a dead carcass was coming out of my body like a rotten dead animal that's in the sun in the heat with flies flying around it that's what it smelled like and i told my girlfriend i said you're lucky you don't live with me i actually bought febreze i'm not a fan of commercial deodorants and commercial air fresheners and commercial laundry detergents but I thought I need to buy you know the good stuff and I bought another bottle of Febreze for the carpet I was afraid that the smell would get stuck in the carpet or in the the comforter or in, in the mattress so yeah I bought both of these because the smell was that bad and I joke with this you know people are wearing N95 masks because of COVID we'll try this on I, the joke is that this is the only kind of thing that will protect you from that smell. So now I'm laying in bed, 
and I got the fan under the bathroom. I'm afraid I won't be able to go to sleep because of the fan, plus the smell. I was offended by how bad it smelled, and if it was somebody else in the house that made that smell, I would have kicked them out. Over the course of the next six weeks, I was able to increase my dosage a little bit from like a couple taps to four taps to more and more, and I got up to one scoop, and the smell of it drops 90% in six weeks, and then I was at full dosage. So it took me six weeks to get to one of these scoops, and the smell wasn't nearly as bad as what it used to be. Now, I felt so cleaned out. And I really learned my lesson about how powerful this supplement is. So let me share with you another thing that's really amazing is that I hardly ever use Q-tips to clean out my ears. All my life, maybe four times a year, I would use a Q-tip. And it would be, you know, some wax. Nothing to speak of regarding this wax. Well, after I used this powder, I happened to use some Q-tips. And the wax that showed up on the end of that Q-tip was big and dark orange and smelly. My ears got cleaned out this way. And when you think of detoxing, most people think of fiber. Like you drink some fiber and it goes down and it cleans and it acts like a broom and your digestive system is push, pushing it this way and gravity is pushing it down. But the point is a true binder, a true detox product cleans everywhere and it's energetic and it uh, provides energy. It makes things work better it supplies nutrients and it grabs onto toxins so well that all the toxins it grabs onto leaves your body. So there are some weak detoxifying products that grab on and they move around through your body and then they release it somewhere else. There's a lot of products that do that. Now, Cellcore has other products that detoxify. Here are two HMET binder, that means heavy metal and environmental toxin binder. The environmental toxin specifically is Roundup. 93% of Americans have Roundup coming out of their urine at any time. And it's hard to get Roundup out of your body. It embeds itself into your connective tissue. It replaces a protein called or amino acid called glycine because Roundup is glyphosate. So just look at the words, glycine, glyphosate. It's got a similar um, relationship there in the, in the verbiage of it. That's because they look similar in some aspect of their molecular structure. The other one being Virag Chem Binder. It binds to viruses, radioactive elements, radiation, and chemicals. I have people on these two products at the same time. And people say that now their poop smells like burnt rubber, or somebody else said burnt plastic, or somebody else said it smells like a chemical factory. I had one guy, he's standing up urinating, and he had to flip on the fan because his urine smelled so bad. I had one guy, his skin smelled like sulfur. And his wife was complaining about how he smelled. And, and, your, and the breath changes. That's detoxification. That's a good sign. So your body smells for a little bit, maybe six weeks, maybe six months. But you're getting cleaned out. You're getting all that garbage that, that you've accumulated throughout your whole life. Whether you know it or not. Maybe you did some drugs or took some prescription medications. Those are toxins. Um, maybe you had some exposures in the air that you never even knew about car exhaust, plastic uh, food storage containers in the kitchen. There are many ways to get exposed to toxins. And these two are fantastic for getting a wide variety out. And they are designed to target certain toxins. Now for this carboxy powder, I'm going to read to you what their website says. When a supplement company puts words on their website to describe their product, it has to be quite technically correct. And it can't say too much because the FDA reads all their information and will flag them and tell them to take it down if it's too specific, especially towards a disease condition. So I'm going to read this. It says, Carboxy is a binder that contains short and long-term carbons, which travel to different areas of the body to remove harmful environmental elements. So these long chain carbon ch chains, they stay in your intestines. The short chain carbon chains can go deep into your body, into your cells, even into your nucleus and mitochondria and clean all that out. That's the key. Carboxy works systemically to pr promote full body detoxification, moving beyond the gut. Carboxy contains electrolytes to nourish you, humic and fulvic acid compounds to detoxify you, and polysaccharides, which help repair damage done to cells by toxins. It also promotes increased energy production at the cellular level. 
I could feel it. I could feel my energy going up taking this product. This reparative mechanism and ability to promote life is what sets carboxy apart from tr traditional binders. This is also very important. It promotes life. Now contrast that with everything at the pharmacy. Everything at the pharmacy is designed to squash life. Antidepressant, anti-anxiolytic, anti-everything. This product improves nutrition, absorption, and utilization. The carboxy complex encourages increased absorption, retention, and utilization of all the nutrients in food, minerals, vitamins, and other supplements. Selective binding. Carboxy is selective in what it binds to, which means it will not remove nutrients or trace minerals that your body needs. Most binders do take out everything. Then you have to add in extra minerals and extra nutrients to make up for it. It's safe to take with food and most other supplements, making it an effortless addition to your supplement regimen. It supports detoxification from environmental toxins. Short and long chain carbons travel systemically to encourage the removal of environmental toxins from deep within the body's cells and tissues. It also supports the maintenance of normal inflammation levels. So the last part means it promotes healing. Inflammation is one section of the healing cycle. There's a whole bunch of biochemical uh, mechanisms that go that increase and then decrease uh, from the initial part of trauma or exposure to the latter part of healing. So inflammation is at the beginning of that healing cycle. So it's not an anti-inflammatory. It's actually a pro-healing nutrient. And it removes the chemical toxins that cause inflammation in the first place. Carboxy is different from traditional clay or charcoal binders. The binding ability of older binders is limited because clay and charcoal contain what are called spent carbons. Think of a spent carbon as a sponge that soaks up toxins specifically in the gut. Like a sponge, once it's full, it drops and leaks, leaving behind toxins it cannot carry anymore. The short and long chain carbons in carboxy travel beyond the gut and have more energy available than spent carbons. The reason why it has more energy available is because they add a bunch of hydrogen to it. Hydrogen is acid. Acid is power or energy like fire. Alkaline is energy like melting. You want to take a supplement that has a lot of energy, like fire, to like your um, the energy that your body uses is called ATP, and the P of ATP stands for phosphorus. If you have a handful of phosphorus and you add oxygen to it, just in the environment like this, it burns. That's fire. Okay, we're talking about more energy rather than spent carbons. This means there is a greater potential for carb carboxy to interact with unwanted substances and safely remove them. This creates the unique ability to bind and repair that spent carbons lack. Carbon technology also supports the balance of the electrochemistry of the human body. People with high toxicity levels may use this product to, to support systemic detoxification from environmental toxins. What that st sentence means is that, so carbon technology supports the balance of the electrochemistry electrochemistry, not necessarily just biochemistry or chemistry or organic chemistry, electro. So the electro part means electrons. The movement of electrons is electricity. So when your body's moving electrons, as it does like in incredible quantities and basically at the speed of, le of light, those that movement is electricity. And if you don't have that, you're just dead. Your body has no electricity, your body's dead on the ground. So the more electricity you have, the more electrons you have, and the more movement of electrons brings more and more life. And how do you bring more electrons into the body? We have these carbon chains, and on the carbon chains, you, you may have oxygen, you may have hydro hydrogen, but dangling off the end of these carbon chains is electrons. And those electrons freely move back and forth, and they're donated and they're received, by these carbon chains. So if your body needs more electrons, these carbon chains donate the electron and you get more energy. And if you have too much energy, possibly, have you ever heard of the term free radicals? These carbon chains will then receive the electron and hold on to it. Carboxy is selective in what it binds to, meaning it will not bind to nutrients or trace minerals that are actually beneficial to your body. This is brilliant. This is key. And I don't know of any other product line that does this. 
It is safe to take with food and most other supplements. And it actually will clean the food or clean that supplement and add nutrients to it. And they mentioned three particular supplements that you don't want to take these binders with. And uh, here's two of them, Para 1, Para 2, and the third one is called Para 3 from their product line. I'm going to take some right now. I got this glass of water right here. And then here's my powder. So did you see that? How... So I had some come out. It's, it flows like sand. So I'm going to put it back in there. Now I got it on my fingers too. See how it turns black and the, it becomes the water. It becomes part of the water. So stir it up just a little bit. That's all it takes. You know, I'm sure you've taken powders before. We have to stir it for three minutes. And then it's still clumpy when you put it in your mouth. So it smells like vinegar out of this bottle. And it tastes like rocks. It's a nutrient from soil. I've never eaten a rock before, but that's what it tastes like. If you're interested in taking this and you're a patient in my office, talk to your practitioner. The bottle has 80 servings. Now, as I mentioned, it may take you a few weeks to ramp up to one serving per day. You got to start with microdosing and test it and see how your body responds based on what comes out of you and based on if you get bloating or not. Now, the bottle itself may last you three months or if you're going really slowly, even up to five months. Keep that in mind when you see the price. And warn your spouse. As a matter of fact, bring your spouse over here right now. I'll wait. You can put me on pause. Now that your spouse is here, let me talk to, let me talk to them. Okay, so I'm going to give you a warning right now that your significant other is going to go through this program and they're going to take this powder called carboxy powder and don't be surprised that when they go to the bathroom half the house smells like a dead carcass okay so buy some febreze as a matter of fact febreze doesn't even work too well this is tropical or island fresh so combine this with the worst smell ever and just mix it all up and it's it's not pleasant at all. You got to have a better product than that. Here's a product that one of my employees actually makes. It's called Third Level Essentials, and this really cuts it through, cuts through the smell. And she gave me this bottle because I was telling the story on the phone to somebody, and this my employee almost barfed right there on the floor. And she go, she goes here, just take this <laughs> home with you. And uh, I bought this for Breeze because I didn't want the smell to get locked up in the carpet. And buy some candles, you know, like this one smells really good like that but it only has one wick so maybe you want one with three wicks like that and uh, light those all around the house and um, don't be mad I take full responsibility don't blame your spouse it's on me it's my fault that your house smells it's my fault that your electric bill is going to go up because the fans always have to be running to, to get that air outside of the house as fast as possible you might want to invest in some bigger fans and wear this to bed. You know, masks are normalized now. I mean, you wear this to the grocery store. People wear these driving. There's no reason why you can't wear this to bed because what if they have to go to the bathroom in the middle of the night? You don't want to be woken up by that. So just put this on before you go to bed. The initial purpose of my YouTube channel was to document my own personal discoveries in the field of healthcare. Then people started watching it. The next purpose of the YouTube channel was to educate people and then since I don't take any insurance, I'm not on any list. It was the marketing for my office. It also became the marketing for a couple other companies that I have. And the whole point, though, is to bankrupt drug companies. And the way that you do that is get lots of people well. YouTube started censoring my channel in the summer of 2018 and again in the summer of 2019. And so I haven't put up a YouTube video in the last three months as of the filming of this video. But what I've been doing for now 14 months is creating ebooks and video courses that are on my website. So let me just show you. Here's an ebook right here. And this is about how the office runs and how we think when we're uh, talking to you about your health care and where you're at, where's your symptoms, what have you done, what has worked, what hasn't worked, where you need to go. And we help you with diet and supplements. Those are the two main tools to get your health back. So with this ebook, you can just start reading it like that. And I believe you have to give us your email address in order to get this, this book. Here's the download button right there. Here's a video. This is my um, inter interview of my origins. And then here's a walkthrough of the practice. And then here's the other practitioners in the office. We've got Carrie, Kristen, Dr. Amanda, and Dr. Taggy. 
And then here's the courses that I've made, Protect Yourself from Viruses, Mold Toxicity, Ketosis. And here's Follow the Physiology Formula, introductory course. This one's free. And then Follow the Physiology ebook, and this is free also. So instead of you trying to poke around through 450 videos on YouTube and try to find what you need, you can just go into these courses and I give you everything and I don't hold back. Here's this landing page for the ebook on the office. Now, what's the value of learning about how we think? What we're doing is we're creating a new culture in healthcare. So when you say, oh, I have pain, instead of going to urgent care and getting a painkiller, which will cause kidney problems, liver problems, you know, medications all make side effects. Every single medication has negative side effects. Every single medication is designed to block, obstruct, delete, instead of enhance or heal. Right, So the new culture is actually healing. That's the way it was prior to World War II. And then Big Pharma got really strong, and now we have what we have. So I'll put the link below, and you can go to this landing page. You can cruise through these chapters and see if you want to download it. I suggest you do, and learn in greater detail about this culture of healing. Okay, remember about this powder, microdose. My favorite quote in all of healthcare is from Dr. Henry Harrower, the father of endocrinology in 1932, he basically said you have to feel your way through. Just like no doctor can give you a dosage for how much salad to eat or how much food to eat in one meal, you got to let your appetite di dictate that. Well, same thing with supplements. Um, there are some general rules of thumb. If you take too much, you can feel it, or too little and there's no effect. You have to feel your way through and change the dosage as you need to.